First Alert Weather with forecaster Steve Gannon. Not a lot of foot traffic in Jackson at this hour. There's plenty of cold air in Jackson, however. And the Pocatello Farm Bureau time lapse showed some snow early this morning. Turned to fog later in the morning. The fog came and burned off. We had a little haze trapped at the valley. That's common during these times of temperature inversion. At this hour from the Farm Bureau Sky Cam in Pocatello, no smoke or no fog, no snow, but no heat either. Two degrees below zero in Pocatello. Other area temperatures are equally chilly. 11 below in Jackson, hence not much foot traffic in the downtown area. And even a little bit of wind. Idaho Falls has a 5 mile an hour breeze and 7 degrees below zero. Look what that does to the wind chill. It makes it just downright uncomfortable. So, how long is it going to continue, it being the cold weather? Well, first things first. No radar to report anywhere in the area. No snow, no inclement weather to deal with and the reason being is we've got three high pressure systems one off the northern california coast one along the washington to british columbia border and one along the idaho utah border that's going to keep all the storm to the north and to the west as viper radar shows we're not expecting much on tomorrow or tomorrow for new year's eve a little fog in the morning but nothing in the way of cloud and shower activity in fact even the fog burns off by tomorrow afternoon reforming for new year's day but by 7 o'clock, most of the fog is gone, and by New Year's afternoon and evening, all of the fog is gone. But bundle up tonight, 15 below in Stanley, 10 below out on the desert at the Inel, 9 below in St. Anthony, a minus 8 in Rexburg, 16 below in West Yellowstone, actually above zero for Burley and near zero for American Falls. But everybody else has got a minus sign in front of all those temperatures. And tomorrow, we're not expecting much of a warm-up. 11 in Pinedale, 12 for Star Valley in Jackson, 14 Montpelier, Soda Springs, Idaho Falls, Aberdeen, 15 for Pocatello, Lava Hot Springs, a little warmer in Malad at 18, a little cooler in, uh, well, not really, 16 in West Yellowstone, a lot cooler in Salmon, 9, and very strong temperature inversions in the Lemhi Valley. But take, the, take a look at the difference between tomorrow's forecast high of 14 in Pocatello and next Thursday's forecast high of 36. We're likely to see some fog to end and begin the new year. We're likely to see a threat of some snow next Wednesday and Thursday for the southern Snake River Plain, but 14 tomorrow for a high in Blackfoot, 34 for a high next Thursday. That's 20 degree swing. We like the looks of that. I'm not sure I'm real impressed with the snow that may be coming. As I get older, I'd lots rather mow lawn than shovel snow. But it is January, and it is going to warm up, especially Wednesday and Thursday of next week. That's for the Upper Valley. For Idaho Falls, Rexburg tells the same tale after a high of only 14 tomorrow. And another couple of nights of overnight below zero temperatures, we're going to be close to 30 degrees by the middle of next week. But we may pay a price by having to shovel a little bit of snow. Boy, you don't want to go to the Lemhi Valley if you want to warm up. Single-digit highs through Sunday and below zero overnight lows through Saturday night. The snow is also forecast to get a little bit more excitable come next Wednesday. But in the Jackson area, we're looking for some snow showers to start on Sunday. But after a high of 12 tomorrow, we're expecting 20s for highs on Wednesday and Thursday of next week. But again, the price you pay for the increased chance of snow, or the increased temperatures, is an increased chance of snow. So it's sixes, you get one or the other. Yeah. yeah. At this point, I think I'd rather shovel than mm -hmm. the snow. Yeah. Now, is it just a myth that it doesn't snow when it's really, really cold? Oh, no. It snows all the time in Antarctica, and temperatures are <laughs> a lot closer to, um, you know, yeah. 25. But, but have you heard that, too? I have. And it's, it's kind of a, it's one of those... Old lifestyles. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but it's a, no, it's, it can snow... When it's really cold. When it's really cold, absolutely. All right. Thank you, Steve. Well, coming